Here we go again. You got um, Trump. Again, nothing against Trump. Now, with this Devin Gibson, talk about so we got to save, um, protect Trump. Um, they never, and it says text Iowa, um, Trump, make America great again in 2024. I tell you, it's not going to be no, 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 uh, Trump. No, no election, I stand because uh, you see, this is the problem, right? Just like I was listening to the woman, um, uh, she's right. You know, I don't know what's going on with Trump, though, but it's not going back to no. You cannot make America great again. So, all what I done heard is everything is going to, it's going to crash. The beginning of 2024. Now, what I done said here, you know, all this, uh, you know, Thank you, Devin and uh, Trump 2024. Make, a great, make America great again. What did I say? What did I say? Let's go all the way down. What I, what I said, right? And I meant what I said. And I said what I mean, right? Listen. You know, I said, America is done. No turning back. And, and I said, you cannot fix a spiritual issue with a political issue. And... One more I said on here. Understand? And hey, they can get mad all they want, man. See, what I done said. Is. Where I'm at. That Trump is not getting back in in you know, 2024, and that's what that's what it is, right? He is not getting back in because America is done. Understand? So where I'm at, let's go back. All right, all the this right here, you know, Demi Gibson, you know, ah. Uh, Dr. Common Sense and all these people are not focusing on the rapture. They're focused on this world system. They are idolaters, understand? And so a lot of a lot of these Christians are deceived. Totally deceived, understand? So Yeah, the Zegar, I said, I said, ain't no Trump, ain't no Trump is getting back in on White House, man, for real. I've been saying this, I've been warning people, get yourself right with Jesus Christ. And all, you know, they talk about the Supreme Court, we'll, we'll get this overturned, no, I won't, understand? You cannot fix a spiritual issue with a, with a political issue. It's not going to work. Christ can only come back and fix this nation, not Trump. Trump idolatrous, including Devin Gibson, will not enter heaven. So that's all I got to say. And see, let's just listen to what, what the little bit that Trump got to say, then, then I'm going you know, to make my comment. Hey there, willing to violate the U.S. constitutions at levels never seen before in order to win this election. Joe Biden is a threat to democracy. It's a threat. They're weaponizing law enforcement for high-level election interference because we're beating them so badly in the polls. We will restore law and order to our communities, and I will direct a completely overhauled DOJ to investigate every radical, out-of-control prosecutor, of which we have many. They have just tried to bar President Trump from the Colorado ballot using an unconstitutional maneuver that is a bastardization of the 14th Amendment to our U.S. Constitution. Now, listen, uh... That's enough. Trump will not fix no, no America. America is done. America is across over the line. Wars is everything is going on. And then I heard that it's going to be what's going on. It's going to be food prices and everything going up. But you know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to do this real quick, man. I'm just going to do this real quick. Um, um, 
what the woman had to say. And she's right on that. Now let's see what she, let me see. Actually, no, I do not like uh, the, the, uh, I'm just going to do this real quick. Let's see something real quick. <laughs> Early in the Okay. Trump is not going to change anything. No one is. The only one who is able to do that is God. Amen. Now, I, like I said, I don't know whether he is, if, if it's just one ballot in Colorado or if it's the Supreme Court everywhere that he is not going to run. I don't know. I have no idea. This is what I read yesterday. This is what came out yesterday. Um, so I don't really know. And like I said, I don't really care. But people, I noticed that the people got so upset about that. There ain't nothing to get upset over. No, He's not. a man. Yep, just right. like the rest of these politicians. Yep. And I'm not knocking him. Don't get me wrong. Ain't me neither. I'm not knocking him either. But however. But it's time to stop depending on man. And it's time to put your faith and trust in Christ. This is a, this is a sin problem, folks. It's right. a spiritual problem. There is no man on the face of this planet that can be elected to run for anything and fix a spiritual problem. Right. I agree. Period. I agree. It's just not going to work. And the more we realize that, the more we understand that, the better it is. Again, let me reiterate, I don't know what's going on here, and it don't really matter. But I'm going to give you this article, and this just came out this morning. So the Pentagon is now looking at EMP weapons to confront the uh, drone threat to the Red Sea. This has gotten totally out of control. And it's going, this, this um, shipping threat is going to affect everything globally. Gas is going to go up. Food is going to go up. Everything globally is going to go up because of this thing. So the only way that the U.S. and the Pentagon is going to be able to fight it, they feel, is through an EMP. Now, that right there is self. Those Christians who focus on Trump understand this is real distraction here. Just like she says, you know, everything is going to go up in the EMP. They're going to use the EMP to try to stop this um, for taking up the ships and whatnot. But anyway, go. It's going to be the rapture of the church. So that's the reason why I'm telling people: quit focus on Trump. Trump is just a man. Focus on Jesus Christ because you know you need to repent of your sins and get yourself right with Jesus Christ. So quit focus on Trump. Trump ain't go, ain't going to do nothing. You understand? Not. Uh, I don't got nothing against him, but Trump is just a man, like I said. So, she is right on, period. But I will tell you this, they need to repent and turn from their wicked ways or get left behind and go to the halls of the Great Tribulation.